Um, what is that thing? Wait, what does that say right there? Activate me? Huh? Oh boy, what is this? Looks like if a command block and a TNT block had a baby. Eh. All right, I guess I'll just uh, activate it. Huh? Wait, what? Pause. This is Minecraft, but there are custom command blocks. I've added some custom blocks into Minecraft that you'll see later in this video. And yes, that explosive command block is one of them. Will I be able to beat the dragon by activating the weirdest command blocks? Watch to find out. Also, be sure to check if you're subscribed and like the video because according to YouTube statistics, you most likely aren't. Oh yeah, and one more thing. A lot of you have been asking me if there's a way to play these mobs that I usually showcase in my Minecraft butt videos. So I've now created a Patreon. And not only you get all the downloads to every mob from my Minecraft butt videos, but you get to support the developers I work with in order for these videos to exist. Enjoy the video and I hope you have a great day. Three, two, one. Oh, hi, spider. Bah! All right, let's get started and just get a bunch of materials real quick. Oh! Uh, uh, oh, God, oh, God, oh, God. There's like a pillager outpost nearby. Oh, it's right there. Oh, they're mad, they're mad, they're mad. Oh, my God, I'm just gonna enter it. <laughs> I know there's a chest up here. Bah! Wood. All right, I'll just take this. Um, What an interesting start that we haven't even experienced before. This is interesting. All right, first things first, I'm just going to patch this up so they'll just not enter and, you know, shoot me with their crossbows. And let's actually get some materials real quick. Here we go. It's stone moment. All right, I'm running out. I'm running out. Ow! Get me out of this place! Now, for today, we're just going to go and, like, kill a bunch of mobs and do a bunch of stuff. Because we are going to go and just break the game by using command blocks in survival. Usually, that's not a thing that you could do in Minecraft. But for today, we're going to make it happen. Now, along with these custom items, I have some custom crafts. So, the first thing that we are going to do is make some bread. But also, there's this custom craft for us to go and get a specific item that we need that is going to be used in a lot of these custom command blocks. And that is going to be redstone. There's going to be a lot of redstone for us to use. And there's actually a custom craft in order for us to go and get a lot of redstone instead of just, you know, mining it in the caves. And we actually are going to have to use a bunch of food. I got like raw beef, raw meat, raw bread. If we put all of our food in a crafting table, this is what happens. Yeah, it's a stack of redstone dust. This is the key to success. You know, honestly, I would like to get more wood, which is going to segue us to the first command block. Let's just get a bit of wood blocks right here real quick. And then we're going to put it in our crafting grid right here to make oak wood. And then we're going to turn all of this redstone dust into blocks in order for us to go and make this. Bah! <laughs> the wooden command block. This is going to be kind of weird. I know, I know. This is a new type of command block and it's very uh, wooden looking. Now we have to make sure to add a redstone signal to this command block in order for us to execute a special command. All right, here we go. I'm going to place a redstone block next to it. Bah! Oh, that's what it does. Yeah, there's going to be all types of interesting things that these custom command blocks are going to be doing. So I guess the wooden one just gives us a bunch of wood. Not surprising. Holy crap, my inventory is filled. I didn't even know that. We have spruce trapdoors, fences, pressure plates, wood logs. Oh, we have a wooden sword. Well, this is a great time for me to just... Oh! We actually need more food for us to get more redstone. So honestly, we're going to have to be killing a lot of mobs today. Wait, I just realized all the trees have been cut down from me just like executing this command block. Bruh, the leaves are decaying everywhere. What the heck? Well, now that we have a bunch of wood, we could actually go and make the next command block and it's actually another simple one really all we need to do is just get a just a bit of wood here to make a pickaxe a wooden pickaxe to be exact let's get more redstone right here boom so we could go and make more redstone blocks and then we're gonna go and put the pickaxe in the middle just like this to make a pickaxe command block oh boy oh boy i think i'm gonna have to go and put a trail of redstone dust for this one boop 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 all right, I'm going to go and push this button real quick. Oh. Huh? Ah! Huh? Ah! Oh my god! Holy crap! Wait, what? There's chests? I must go down to check the chests. All right, I'm going down. Let's see what this is. Hello, chests. Hello, hello, hello. Oh my goodness. I think I just realized what's going on here. Every single one of these chests has just ores and cobblestone as if a pickaxe just mined the whole entire trunk and it's all in these chests dude oh my god okay we could just get full diamond um three two one diamond moment we're just full diamond now not only that but we also have like all the iron that we need and redstone dust we don't even need to go and make like our own custom redstone dust anymore we could just go and take it from these chests 
Yonk, yonk. Dude, we could get like coal and emeralds too. We could go and hopefully find a village nearby and just trade for all the things that we need from the villagers. It's easy. <laughs> huh? Oh! This is a village? Oh, it's a village. Okay, nice, nice, nice. There's a lot of nice resources in this village that we could go and take. There's villagers that we could trade with. There's hay bales, which means that there's a lot of food. And there's farms as well. Oh, yeah, and we could also go and trade with the cleric. So we could go and get ender pearls from the cleric by trading with the cleric. Oh, yeah, and also one more thing. Um, Hey, hey, hey Iron Man. Oh! All right, let's go and farm some stuff. Let's take a bit of this real quick. Be oh. Oh, uh, we have potatoes. We could make a command block out of this. Block of redstone, potato in the middle. Bah. Yay, potato <laughs> command block. Gee, I wonder what this is going to do. Ah, this is very starchy. Okay, here we go. Potato. Huh? Huh? <laughs> oh my god. It's just a giant potato. Oh my god. What's in here? Huh? What's going on here? Oh, um. <laughs> this is a very powerful potato. Oh boy. Every single one of these chests just baked potato. Okay. Well, at least we don't need to worry about our food source any longer. This is how to flex on the Irish. Oh boy. Here, let's go back to the cleric. I want to see if the cleric will actually give us some uh, ender pearl trades, perhaps. Let's go and trade the cleric with the redstone real quick. We got to upgrade the cleric, by the way. So this might take a bit of emeralds. You greedy, greedy villager. Okay, let's go trade the cleric with a bunch of lapis now. There you go. Okay, and now redstone. Thank you. Good business. Good business. And... Oh! Oh, we got the wrong trade. You see, there's a chance that I could actually not get ender pearls from the cleric. So, uh, I guess the only thing that we could do is just... You scam me! Scammer! Let's try this again. Hello, any fellow farmers would like to become a cleric? Anyone? Hmm? All right, we got a new cleric. Let's try again. Let's do trading moment. Oh! Thank you! I am not getting scammed by this cleric. I am very happy. We have 12 ender pearls, and we could probably get more. You know, this farm is just giving me ideas of another command block that we could also do. Because the farm has farmland, and you want to know how to get farmland, you need a hoe. Let's go and make a hoe real quick. Let's just do an iron hoe, for example. Yes. As we all know, this is farmland, and this is a hoe command block. <laughs> hey, cow, you want to see something cool? Hmm? Check this out. And also check this out. Oh, my God. <laughs> oh, it's a, it's a farm. Well, that's, that's nice. This is kind of a farm inception. That's another farm. Oh, boy. What the heck, dude? Um, You know, we could honestly just do it again. <laughs> my God, there's even more. It's whole time. Oh, my God. Okay, it just ate the command block. It literally just ate the command block. Well, I just literally kept spamming the commands until, like, half of the village is now just farmland, dude. Oh, this looks like Kansas. We have a bunch of hoes now, so that's that's cool, I guess. Let's make another one, shall we? Huh? Wait. Wait, that's the... That's the achievement to get the netherite. <laughs> All right. Well, we have... uh. Just a bunch of hoes everywhere. This is a lot of hoes, dude. There are so many hoes that I hope that YouTube doesn't demonetize me or something. Okay. But you want to know a command block that would pair well with the hoe command block? The ore command block. This one. It turns anything into an ore. Let's just, uh, you know, place it next to... Oh, we got more hoes, by the way. Let's just place a redstone signal next to uh, this command block. We're going to place a signal right here. Ah! Ah! Oh, part of the farmland has just turned into a uh, straight up ores. There's redstone, diamonds, emeralds, gold, iron, coal everywhere. It's even on the trees. That was a tree right there. Everything within the vicinity just turned into ores, dude. What if I do more? Potato? Huh? Oh, broken game. Oh my God. This is so cursed. The giant potato ore has almost broke my game. My FPS, it's at like 20. It's like I have a 2011 MacBook. No! This world's out here looking like a UHC scenario. Oh God. Now there's actually another command block that I want to show you that involves this lad right here. We got to go and get some rotten flesh from that zombie. Oh, let's go over here real quick. Hello, zombob. Whoa! Rotten flesh. That's all we need here. All right, let's get out. Let's get out. Now, this is going to be probably a very scary command block, but I hope this is not going to kill us. The mob command block. Okay, I'm going to run a little further away from the village because I don't want to, you know, completely jeopardize it more than I already did. I mean, look at this place. This is not even a village anymore, dude. This is cursed. Or maybe blessed. 
It looks like a blessed Minecraft thumbnail. Anyways, I am going to go and place this mob command block in the middle of the plains here. And now I'm going to give it a redstone signal in three, two, one. Bow! Oh! Run! What is happening? Leave! Oh God. Oh God. Oh God. Oh God. <laughs> There's three different mobs that are mad at me. I've conceived you all! And this is what you do! Boo! Oh my god, there's blazes. Wait, we can get blaze rods from this. Bah! Oh, I got a blaze rod. Okay, that's cool. <laughs> was that an endermite? I think that was an endermite. Don't care. Yeah, there's a lot going on here. What the heck, dude? Wait, this is a portal right here. Wait, we could use this portal to go to the nether or something. I mean, technically, we could just keep spawning more and more mob blocks in order for us to go and get blaze rods so we could go and make eyes of ender. I mean, I almost died from just commanding it once, from executing the command block just once, dude. I don't know if it's worth just getting one or two blaze rods from just almost dying. So maybe I don't think it's a nice source for us to go and, you know, get the blaze rods. And I think instead we should probably go to the nether and order for us to get not only resources to get the eyes of ender but there's netherite in there and i want netherite there is some obsidian and i'm pretty sure there's also some lava box that we could use to go and create this portal so uh let's do it we'll put this right here bah! all right let's go and take two of this obsidian all right now that we have the two obsidian we could just do this bah, bah! and now it is done that is a completed nether portal let's go and take a fire charge from this chest and just light it up we are are ready to go to the nether but before we go we still have some more command blocks for me to show you guys wait a minute what's that behind me these are feathers let's try the feathers boop 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 those are red stones and now we add the feather in the middle elytra command block fly through the sky let's try it i guess huh 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 ah! okay that that's cool dude yeah all right right <laughs> Oh, this is an SMP nightmare. Oh, God, no. The worst mob in the game. Phantoms. No. They look like a bunch of flies just hovering around the light bulb. This is horrible. At least we have elytra and fireworks on the floor. I'll, I'll be sure to take this, I guess. Thank you, game. I'm just gonna get away from that. That is cursed. I'd rather go to this cursed part of the map instead of the other cursed part. Wait, what's happening? Wait, there's a raid happening? Oh, no. Wait, this is really bad. Oh, no. Hey, yo, I need I need to trade with my cleric. I'd like to get more ender pearls. What's going on here? Cleric, where's the cleric? Oh, cleric. Hello. Hi, I would like to do a trade with you. Thank you. Goodbye now. I'm leaving your village forever because I do not want to deal with the people that you are getting raided by. Wow, I'm such a great businessman. All right, we got our pearls. We should probably leave now because, you know, there's literally a war in the background. So I'm, I'm just going to go. All right, what's next here? All right, all right. What? Huh? We're in the middle of like a field and there's this. A pyramid. Wait, there's TNT in this pyramid, isn't there? Hello, is anyone here? Okay, let's just go down. Oh. That is TNT. Let's go take a bunch of this TNT real quick. Is there anything in the chest before we leave? Oh, there's power three. I'll be taking this. This is going to be very nice for the bow. All right, we should get out of here now. This is literally perfect for us because we could go and use the TNT for a special custom command block we can do this uh boo <laughs> that's a very red command block an explosive command block to be exact this one goes kaboom i really wonder why um am i gonna die doing this huh Whoa! Okay, although I didn't die, it kind of killed me from the inside. At least we have a bunch of TNT now. So that's that's cool, I guess. Holy crap, there's stacks and stacks of TNT to be exact. Oh my god. You could honestly use this TNT for a lot of nice things like blast mining or something. Or instead of blast mining, we could actually use a pickaxe command block again. Maybe in the nether. Speaking of the nether, we should probably go back to our uh, nether portal that we lit from earlier so we could enter it and find good things. That would allow us to make us die not as fast. Woo! netherite i think this is actually a good time for us to go and use our elytra and just get out of here let's go back it's time to enter the nether we are back hello all right we are just gonna go straight in here into the nether let's do this here we go oh uh, oh boy all right this nether looks pretty cool and it's gonna be really easy for us to go navigate around here because we could literally fly around 
and do whatever we want. I think the first main thing that we should do is find the nether fortress so we could get blazes to kill in order for us to get the blaze rods. However, we should honestly do one thing here first before any of that. We should go and make a pickaxe command block. Let's go and make our pickaxe real quick. There you go. And then we're going to go and surround it with blocks of redstone. Boop. Pickaxe command block. And now we just do this. There you go. Oh my gosh. Oh, oh. There's a bunch of chests down there again. Okay. Hello. Ow. Hello, chests. Um, any nice things for me, please? Oh, there's plenty of things. Wait. I see it. Ancient debris. Yes. It mined a bunch of gravel, netherrack, magma blocks. Some uh, gold as well. Some quartz, but most importantly, the ancient debris. That is a lot of ancient debris. Holy crust. Let's go and smelt this ancient debris. Here we go. Boop. And also boop. There you go. Very nice. All right. Now we got some netherite scrap. Here we go. And we could also do this. Boom, boom. Um... This is the netherite command block. It turns anything into netherite. All right. That literally took one scrap. Holy crust. All right, let's get out of this chunk real quick. I want to go and use this netherite command block right around here. Let's do this. Boom. This is a really cool netherite command block. All right. And then this. Oh, my goodness. Oh. oh my gosh that's a lot it also goes down too it goes all the way down this is like thousands and thousands of netherite ingots okay let's just take one <laughs> there it is a block of netherite and two ingots <laughs> all right let's go and make a smithing table as well boop and then we do this netherite chest plate let's go with the leggings as well along with the helmet and also the boots we are full netherite, dude. Not only that, but I'll have the tools as well. There you go. And now we are very powerful. You might be wondering, oh, he's powerful because he's full netherite. But actually, in reality, it's because I have a stack of netherite hose. <laughs> yep. All right, now we're really ready for like the fortress. We are ready to go. Let's get out of here now. Fortress time. Come on, game. Give me a fortress, please. I would like a fortress moment. Come on. Oh, oh, yes. Yes! All right. Thank you, game. Thank you for the fortress moment. Oh, we could go and get our blaze rods right here. Blaze rods, blaze rods, blaze rods. Woo! We have two blaze rods. We got four blaze rods and five. Six blaze rods now. We have seven. Honestly, don't mind getting one more right here. Mm bah. Yes. Okay, we have eight blaze rods. We could honestly leave right now. All right, we're leaving. Goodbye, nether. Let's go back to our portal, shall we? Where's our portal? Oh, there's our portal. It's a different portal. Oh, it's a different portal. Mm. I kind of lost where my initial portal went, so uh, we might have to just use this one. Let's go add these two right here, and we're just going to have to do a lot of obsidian moments. All right, now that we have our obsidian, let's just go and do this. And that, we have a completed portal. Oh, I forgot a flint and steel. So uh, we're just gonna have to add some like wood right here or something. There you go. Let's add some lava right here. There you go. And now I think it's just gonna naturally burn for us to light up this portal. Yes! Oh, that was so easy. It was so quick. And we're in here. Hello, overworld. All right, let's go up here. Let's go to the surface. Oh, it's nighttime. Hello, nighttime. All right, it's time for us to go and make Eyes of Ender. Mm bah. Where is it at? Oh, it is that way. Now, before I leave, I hear some spiders nearby. I need some string badly. Bah! Let's get one more piece of string now. Bah! Oh, thank you for the string. All right, now that we have our string, let's go and quickly make a bow. Boom. Bow time. Now that we have a bow, we could also go and make an anvil right here. There you go. Now we do one of these. Boom, boom. This is going to be in preparation for when we have to go and kill the dragon. We got a power three bow. Nice. I think this is it. Ah! Yes, it is. Oh, it's this chunk right here. It is this chunk. Very, very nice. This is where the stronghold's at. Literally right under us. However, unfortunately, I only have like an arrow. Um, I got to go and farm some chickens to get feathers so we can get arrows for us to shoot the dragon yeah let's go and uh do a quick chicken moment Whew, we got 24 feathers from the chickens now we gotta go and like find some flint somewhere so we could go and uh you know get some flint is there any in this cave hmm is there any gravel nearby hmm oh yes there is all right it's gravel time here we go and 
We got 24 flint. Along with 24 feathers. We can make a lot of arrows out of this. Boom, 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 boom. That is a stack and a half of arrows. Nice. All right, we're back here. And we're just going to go mine straight down. Because there is a stronghold right under us. Here we go. Let's do this. It's time for stronghold moment. Let's do this. Here we go. Come on, where it's at. Come on, just give me the portal. Give me the portal. Oh, the portal. Yes, okay. Boom, 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 boom. All right, we're ready to go. We can do this. Now, before we enter, I want to make a special command block that I have not yet made. There's a reason why I packed up a bunch of redstone, blocks of redstone to be exact. And the reason is because I want to go and make a lot of custom command blocks right here. Bang! And by doing so, I get to do a very special command block. The best custom command block. And you know what? Screw it. I'm gonna go and make even more different custom command blocks right here. We have 20 custom command blocks for us to go and make this. The best command blocks. We have unique custom command blocks right here. 20 in total along with the blocks of redstone for us to go and make this. Boom and boom. Double command block! Yes! It is the power of all command blocks. Every single custom command block that has been presented here today will be in one command block boom the beautiful thing is that we have four of these this is a very very costly command block that's taken a bunch of resources for us to do very awesome things with and we are gonna go and execute these commands in the end fight let's do this here we go it's time here we go all right let's shoot these crystals real quick bang 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 bong boy Ooga. Oh, I'm going to use my elytra for the hard to reach ones up here. Let's go up. Let's shoot them down. Yeah. There's another one right there. Yes. I think we got all of them. Oh, we did. It's time for us to go and put our armor back on. And I'm actually going to eat the golden apple because I am going to go and ignite this command block. Here we go. Oh, it's all of them. It's all of them. <laughs> oh, my God. Oh, my God. That was insane. Oh, oh God. I got to get my stuff back before everything goes bad. Okay, 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 okay. I have an idea. I have an idea. What I mean that every single command block has been executed. I mean every single one of them. Even the mob one too. I have an idea. Hold on. We're going to do a tactical crafting table right here. And we're going to go and make a boat. Boom. Oh my God. I see all this stuff right there. Oh, let's just go down. Just go down. My stuff is right there, dude. Take the stuff. That was so chaotic. I can't believe we're still alive and we're still in. All right, all right, all right. This is the greatest recovery, man. Holy crap. That was so cursed. I'm still alive. You can't stop me, dragon. I'm going up. We're out. The fight is not over. Hey, yo, come here. Become slain, dragon. Oh, it's going down. Here it comes. Here it comes. Whoa. Oh, oh my god. Go back to safety. Woo! Halfway! Dude, you know what? Screw it. It is time for anarchy mode. Oh, it's anarchy mode. I can't tell if this was worth it at all, but I can assure you this is pretty chaotic. <laughs> what am I done to the end? What is happening? Come on, dragon! What is this end fight, dude? Oh my god, it's hitting the phantoms. It's almost there. It's time for two at the same time. Bang. Oh! What is this audio subtitling? There's so much happening! Oh! Ooga! Oh my god, what have I done to this end? Let's go and get the egg. Let's place a button right there. Break this. There goes the egg. And now we have the egg. There you go. That's how you beat Minecraft in the most chaotic way using custom command blocks. Thank you for watching. Bye.